And what we've actually been able to do is to find a threshold that we expect life to emerge, which is what you described as this spontaneous to selection dynamics. And it actually has, you know, for the physics nerds out there, it has like properties of a phase transition, right? So you go from spontaneous, like random configurations of objects to selected ones that have this historical pathway. The so phase transition is all the molecules are this way, and then like a moment later, they're in a whole other way. Configuration? Yeah. So, so, but we, we live this. Yeah. Right. Okay. Uh, we, we, it's our fancy word for it, but when water becomes ice. Ice. That's a, ice is that's not a phase, water. Right. That's a phase transition. Exactly. When water becomes steam, steam it's a phase there transition. There you go. And so we actually generalize that term even in the early universe. If the, the if there's everything is this way and then something happens and then it's another way, we just call it a phase transition. Gets us through. And we geek out on that. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. We physicists love phase almost transitions. Almost anything can happen through a phase transition. <laughs> right. That's right. And uh, like spooky things, fun things, yes. dangerous things. Yes. So I shake the Legos. 